Good morning, Adrian, Eric, and Deval. This is Daniel here from Turtle and Lexus, Pacific Turtle of Cairns. This is your beautiful virtual tour of this beautiful 2020 LDV G10. Done around 71,000 kilometers for 24,990 driveway, including all your on road costs and registration. Um, before I get into the HD virtual tour of this beautiful vehicle and you know go through the engine bay, the exterior, the interior, as well as the logs book, log books, I just want to tell you a little bit about our dealership here up in Cairns. So we actually have two used vehicle dealerships here up in Cairns. This being the first one at 77 Mulgrave Road, probably about a kilometer or two from Cairns CBD. We do have another yard down that road down there, and that's at 235 Mulgrave Road next to our new car showroom. So as you can see, um, we are stocked up. Um, between the two yards, we're probably stocking about maybe 230 cars at any time during the month. And we sell about maybe 200 to 220 cars a month. Um, the reason that being is we're a high volume dealership. We price all our cars to sell. So that's probably why you inquired on our beautiful LDV. If we're not the best value in all of Queensland, we're the best value in all of Australia. Being um, one of the biggest Toyota dealership in um, all of Queensland, when you do purchase a vehicle from us, we do provide you a PPSR report that shows you no finance owned on the vehicle. It's never been written off or stolen. No hail damage or any flood damage, anything like that. Um, that just gives you peace of mind that you're buying um, a quality car from a reputable dealership with a clean title as well. Um, that being said, anyways, thank you so much for all um, your inquiry. This, um, yeah, this vehicle is obviously um, a very, very popular vehicle at the moment because the way it's priced. I'm ready for immediate delivery and then let's go. Let's have a look at the um, underneath here. Have a look at the engine bay, all nice and tidy. As you can see, all nice and clean as well firewall and stuff like that all nice and tidy awesome we'll close that one down we'll have a look at the bottom as well for any stone chips or any scratches anything like that on the paintwork um yeah these virtual tours are made you know to show full transparency so have a look at the bonnet here um i cannot see any stone chips or anything which is that's good that's good to see just trying to look in detail Cars in beautiful condition on the bonnet there. Awesome. The front right guard here. As you know, this is a diesel. As you can see, the badge diesel there. Turbo diesel. I'm pretty sure it's a 1.9 litre. Our front right guard is in beautiful condition. Have a look at the tread. Um, have a look at the tread down here. Um, that's almost a brand new tyre. Plenty of tread on that one. But yeah, um, as you know, all you guys are using this for commercial use, obviously. Um, we are running a um, fantastic end of financial year finance rates. Um, so more than happy to help you guys out. Um, this car is in popular demand. That's why I'm gonna send all these, uh, all these videos to you guys, all three of you guys. Um, Eric, Adrian, and Deval. Um, but yeah, front bumper looks in pretty good, Nick. What I'm noticing, uh, maybe small like, stone chips here. Looks like it has been brush touch, uh, but that does look like a home job sort of thing. More than happy to take it to our own paint shop and get it professionally brush touched and touched up for you guys. That's not a problem. Uh, but besides that, rest of the grill there is in really good nick. Just a little mark here, but it's actually not into the paint. I reckon that will get buffed and polished out for in the detailing stage before it exits the yard. Um, just slightly dirty there, as you can see. Um, but still in very, very clean condition. Definitely for around 71,000 kilometers, and it's in very good nick. Front left guard here. Have a look at the tread again. Beautiful. The wheel arch, all nice and tidy. Have a look at the rim itself. Just very, very minor. Got a rash there um, in there. But overall, it's still been kept in good condition. Have a look up top here. Any stone chips, any scratches, cracks, anything like that. Awesome to see. Um, once again, when we, we, you do purchase a car from us, we do provide you PPSR report, Australian government piece of paperwork. To show you there's no finance, it's never been written off. Stolen, hail damage, flood damage, anything like that. You know, just the morning um, dew on the car. I think that's what they call it. Uh, but yeah, the paint. Is in immaculate condition as you can see 
previous owner has um, kept it in very good nick as you can see you can see the reflection of the car next to us in the paint that's awesome to see um, no dents or anything like that definitely has been kept in good nick that's for sure have a look at the shed at the back here awesome have a look at the wheel arch here all nice and tight and representable rim here slightly got a rash there um but yeah that's the point of these videos just to be fully transparent for you guys um we'll go around the back here as you can see you have your rear parking sensors as well very very useful when you are, are parking to spaces and stuff like that rear reversing camera awesome to see have a look at the back windscreen here no stone chips cracks or anything like that have a look at the paintwork all right open up have a look inside as you know there are dual um two doors doors on each side which is you know for easy access from both sides lots of people you know like to put drawers in the middle so you can have access on this side and have access on this side drawers in the middle which is a good concept you know uh, but yeah it's depending on your businesses that you guys run down there in brisbane um have a look at the interior you know just your general wear and tear um but have a look at the floors here have a look at the side walls um definitely has been kept in good condition that's for sure um just you know genuine wear and tear um still very 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 clean have a look at the back here you know when people are dragging things out of cars you know air conditioning business and stuff like that when they are pulling things out of the car they're not you know they're careless and you know they're not lifting the product out of the car they're pulling it out of the car you do see a lot of you know hard scratches here you know deep scratches in the plastic here or deep scratches down here and the paintwork down here usually in used cars you do see a lot of you know when people are taking prams and stuff out of cars um they're careless they don't lift it they pull it out you do see lots of major scratches is missing but have a look this is in kept in good condition and that's in pretty good nick just a general you know surface little scratches and stuff like that i reckon a little clean that will come up all nice and top nice uh, but yeah you don't see major scratches in the plastic or anything from anyone being careless or anything but yeah there you are dual access um but yeah nice configuration you can set up whatever configuration you want um seals all nice and tidy back bumpers all nice and clean Beautiful. As you know, LDB, um, yeah, just great value for what you can get. Awesome cars. Have a look at the paintwork again on this side. You can see a reflection on this side of this Ford Ranger next to me. Um, once again, cannot fault it. What I'm noticing down here is just a minor, minor paint imperfection, anything like that. That is, look like it's, yeah, it's in, in the paint. More than happy to take that to a paint shop and they can touch that up. So it looks a little bit nicer. And just a minor, minor dent there. Um, that's been very, very picky. That's the only dent I've seen on this car. Uh, more than happy to see if we can get that popped out a little bit by a paintless dip remover. More than happy to do that for you guys. And just a minor one there. Um, more than happy once again to take that to um, a paint shop so they can fill that one in and paint. Open the doors on this side. Have a look at the, uh, the step up here. All nice and clean. I'll go jump in. I'll open up the other side from the inside as you can see. So you can see the condition on the other side here. Quickly jump out. Have a look at the side here. Seals and shit like that. Sorry, didn't mean to swear, my bad. Um, yeah, hope you guys are all having a great weekend. Just wanted to record this video again for you guys so you know um, you can have a watch of it. And um, yeah, see if you guys, what you think. Definitely try and make a move before end of financial year for your tax write off um, reasons and stuff like, like that. Um, yeah. Very good, Nick, that's for sure. Hey, all right, well, we'll hop into the car. Firstly, we'll look at the door card itself. 
you know, when people are getting out of cars, you know, um, especially, you know, vans and stuff like that, you know, you might have your your big boots and stuff like that. You're getting out of your car, your boots like to drag on the side of the, the door cutter. You do see a lot of major scratches and stuff like that. Um, but this has been kept in very good condition. Sorry about the sun. Um, you know, a couple compartments here to put a few things, you know, job cards and stuff like that, your iPads um, that you do your work on. Um, center locking, automatic windows, um, electric um, mirrors as well. Um, but yeah, have a look at the step up that we have here. No rips, tears or stains in the material uh, on the flooring there. Um, have a look at the seats. No rips, tears or any stains. And very, very plump as well, as you can see. Um, have a look at the roof liner. Beautiful. We'll hop in the car. So this LDV does come with um, these keys here. So a general, a general um, key there and one of these ones. Uh, so pull my seat in because I'm a little bit short. Turn her on. Car's sitting at 72,097 kilometers. Um, in very good condition, no warning lights or anything like that. We do provide you with a roadworthy when you buy the car so you don't have to worry. Peace of mind that you are buying from a Toyota um, dealership as well. Um, but yeah, no fingernail marks, no cracks, sun fading, anything like that. Have a look at the dash as well. Turn out the audio because it's not tuned properly. But yeah, have a look at the dash, no cracks, some damage, or anything like that. Um, all your cruise control settings on this side, all your, um, you know, your source settings, mute and all that. Answering your phone and stuff like that. Um, your light settings for your headlights. Um, yeah. Set a console compartment down here. You can make things, you know, I'm sure you guys can figure out there are aftermarket things where you can make it, you know, build it all the way up here, you know, so you can have a rest sort of thing. Um, cup holders down here, USB and your auxiliary multimedia, your 12 volt here. Um, Aircon controls here, this is your, uh, for your fuel, traction control, hazard lights, um, but yeah, very easy to use. Aircon controls, blast the aircon so you can have a listen. Very, very cold. Um, yeah, that's the temperature here. Um, as you know, up in Cairns, we don't like to keep it as cold as possible. As it's very, very hot up in Cairns. Uh, this is your multimedia here. I'll try to tune it to a nice um, radio station so you can have a listen to some music. <laughs> no music on this ch channel here. There we go. Nice and crisp sound, as you can hear. But yeah, very easy to use. You can change it. You can tune it to whatever you want. Um, but yeah turn that off uh, but yeah very easy to use multimedia aux and all that bluetooth and stuff like that uh, but yeah have a look at the roof liner no stains or anything like that wrap it a little bit automatic transmission um, but yeah overall has been kept in great condition just a little general wear and tear on this gear knob here um, but yeah well I'll put you down and we'll go through the service history book for a second Alright, 5,419 service there, service here 15,792, 30,964 kilometers, 41,868 kilometers, 54, uh, 73,426 kilometers, and yeah, 71,026 kilometers. Car's sitting at 72,097 kilometers. Next service is in June to the first month of next year, or 81,000 kilometers. So yeah, car has been good, um, kept in good nick. Warranty and service book is in pretty good condition. Um, pretty good. Um, but yeah, there you are. Appreciate you guys watching the video today. Um, if you do have any questions, anything like that, um, Eric, Adrian, or Duval, happy to help you guys out. Um, but yeah, this car is in popular demand at the moment. So um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. Happy to help you guys out. Email me, text me, even call me. Uh, but yeah, it is end of financial year. So happy to see what we can do for you guys and get this car um, van transported down to Brisbane for one of you guys. Appreciate that. Um, yeah, 
let me know what you think definitely take um advantage of end of financial year and tax write-offs and stuff like that for business purposes appreciate you guys watching this is um a very valuable commercial vehicle ready for um immediate delivery appreciate that guys have a great weekend talk to you soon